Here I have already opened Adobe Dreamware CS6. Now I am opening HTML document. Now to understand transition property, let me insert a div. I'm writing some text inside it. Now, let me give some CSS to this div box. Style. Let me close this style tag. As it's ID, so I'm using hash. Now, I want this 200 pixels height. I want this 200 pixels again. Background color. I pick any of it. Font color I want. Say white. Text align. I want to use center. Let me give you line break. I have not saved up my document yet, so let me save it first and we will look at preview transition property. Now let's preview. We will apply some hover properties to it. That is when we will hover the div it will change its property and then later we will give some transitions to it box hover say on hover I want width of 250 pixels height Again, I want 250 pixels. Background color, pick any of it. Text color, this. Now, I want the change its radius to be. 100% Not. let me save up the changes let's preview in a browser see now when I hover this div the div changes into circle as I have given the radius to be 100% the color is changing from white to green and the background color that was blue is changing to red. All these effects are changing immediately on hover. Now we will give some transition effects. That is the things will change with some animated effect. Let me come to CSS of box. Now notice guys transition property works on four features. That is transition delay. Transition duration, transition property, transition timing function. Now property means if we want to apply transition to any CSS property, say background color, size, text color, any CSS of it. Now duration stands that 
how many seconds or millisecond transition effects takes to complete. Transition timing function means it specifies speed curve of transition effect. That is, if we want it ease in, ease out, ease in out, linear. background color I want 500 millisecond now I want this to be in linear here I mean I want to give transition to background color Speed I want is 500 millisecond and the transition effects going to be linear that is in the same speed. Let me preview in a browser. See when I hover on this box the color changes with 500 milliseconds delay and rest all other properties are changed immediately. See. What if I want to give transition effect to more than one property? See, let me erase this line. Transition property I want background color I want to change width which I want now transition duration I want is one second transition timing function I want this say easy out that is moderate fast moderate now let's preview in the browser. See guys, here what's happening? Text and border radius are changing immediately and rest other properties, background color, height, width are changing with transition effect with delay of one second. Now, what if I give transition to all? See what it happens now. Now, all the properties are taking change with the delay of one second. See, the radius is also changing with the delay of one second. text color is also changing with the delay of one second so this is how we can play with our transition property so this is done friends and if you want to learn these subjects directly from me do contact me do subscribe to my channel have a good day